Let's look at distance, rate, and time. For example, two trains leave this station at the same time. One is heading west and the other east. The westbound train travels 12 miles per hour faster than the eastbound train. If the two trains are 400 miles apart after two hours, what is the rate of the westbound train? So let's let x equal the rate in miles per hour of the westbound train. Now we're told that the westbound train travels 12 miles per hour faster than the eastbound train, which means the eastbound train travels 12 miles per hour slower than the westbound train. Therefore, if x is equal to the rate of the westbound train, then x minus 12 is equal to the rate in miles per hour of the eastbound train. Now we're going to use the famous formula that distance is equal to rate times time to help us solve this problem. Or in symbols, d is equal to r times t. Now let's keep track of things in a table here. So here's R for rate, here's T for time, and here's D for distance. And here is the westbound train, and here's the eastbound train. So X is the rate of the westbound train. X minus 12 is the rate of the eastbound train. And we know something about how far apart the trains are after two hours. So we're going to let t equal 2 here, which means after two hours, the distance that the westbound train has traveled is r times t, or 2x. And the distance after two hours that the eastbound train has traveled is 2 times x minus 12. So if here's the station, and after two hours, the distance that the eastbound train has traveled is 2 times x minus 12, and the distance that the westbound train has traveled after two hours is 2 times x. But we're told that after those two hours, these two trains are 400 miles apart, which means that this total distance is 400. That is, the sum of those two distances has to be 400, namely 2x plus 2 times x minus 12 is equal to 400 or 2x plus 2x minus 24 is equal to 400, or 4x minus 24 is equal to 400, and then adding 24 to both sides, we get 4x is equal to 424, and then dividing both sides by 4 gives us that x, which is the rate we're looking for of the westbound train, is 106 miles per hour. And this is an example of how we use this very important formula here. Distance is equal to rate times time. 
Thank you, and we'll see you next time.